Now, a lot of people judge their pre-workout or beta alanine based on how it feels, the tingles, aka paresthesia, and believe it or not, it's actually a side effect that you could build a tolerance to and has no determination on whether it's working or not. So if you stop feeling them as much, it doesn't mean that your pre-workout doesn't work, and it definitely doesn't mean that you need to switch products. But it's important to note that if it doesn't have 3.2 grams per scoop, it's underdosed. But I hate to break it to you, that's another myth. Research actually supports a total daily intake, not a massive scoop. And not to mention, splitting dosages throughout the day is often better tolerated, especially if you hate the tingles. But there's one more thing I have to tell you. If you don't notice beta alanine working right away, you're probably tolerant to it. I'm sorry, but that's also wrong. Beta alanine isn't an acute ingredient and works by increasing muscle carnosine levels over time. And those benefits are only noticeable after reaching that saturation level. So here's the real takeaway. Beta alanine works and is a great performance ingredient. In fact, one of my favorite. And when you take it consistently, like in a daily pre-workout like this, that's where you're gonna notice the real benefits. So drop a comment down below and let me know what you've been told about beta alanine.